I think our master of choreography is, is a kind of a platform. It's a community where peers of the same interest of, in choreography meet. They're coming to the master because they have an interest in choreography. They already have a practice in choreography. But the intent is, in, is to find how can I make a next step in my development? How can I go deeper and further in my development? And also how can I again step into a learning environment that is inspiring for me as a choreographer? And certainly what choreographers nowadays are looking for is a community where they can share their thoughts, ideas. So in relating to education, I would say there is this formal aspect that students are coming for in regard to what they love to learn. They have an interest in learning, but at the same time they have also a big interest in meeting and meeting with peers, the informal side of things. We are a part-time education, so that means that it's two years, it's part-time, and what does that mean part-times is that there are three blocks every year of two weeks intensives where they are really coming to or Tilburg or Rotterdam and where they meet each other and when they got classes, workshops, lectures, projects, all the stuff. In between, they have their assignments and also what we call blended learning, that they keep on learning in between the moments. We clearly choose to invite people in who have an experience. So the first year is much more an internal process where we guide them through a kind of internal process of learning, discovering, rediscovering aspects maybe that they are not conscious aware of or total new fields what could be an interesting for them and that ends in the first year in a prototype and a prototype meaning a first glimpse of maybe what they would produce in the second year. The second year is much more related to okay how do you bring your practice of choreography in relation with the research you're doing and how can you make these kind of integrations. And it ends at the end of the second year in really creating a, a production in our festival, because we're ending with a festival, where all the productions of the students are being shown. And at the same time, alongside that, they're creating their own research that could end in an act of Jesus or in an exposition. I think also what, what we try to do, we don't want to nurture the students. That's not the thing. We are respecting their adult, that they are adults, but we have a support system around them. So on many levels, we, we created really a coaching system on the level of, for their writing. We sometimes see, certainly in the first year, that not everyone knows how to write on an academic level. So we have writing coaches. We have also for their research, we have mentor circles. And mentor circles are built around Choreographers with a PhD who know very well what research is about and students are coming there together with their mentor. In the second year we have creative coaches as we call them and they are really there to support the student in their final work when they're creating their final choreography. And we have what we also call SFers, uh, that the student facilitators, that are really there to support the student. So it's a mix of lectures, theory, practice, uh, classes, um, intervision moments, talks, uh, drinks. I think everything what creates a community that wants to learn. And certainly, very important what the students themselves find, find interesting and what kind of urge they have to learn. The student needs to bring their own kind of expertise in. That's a field. On the other hand, we bring the field of Fontis and Codarts into it. And on the other hand, all the guest teachers that we invite are people that are really working in the field of choreography on many levels. Also the mentors that are really helping or guiding the students in their research are mostly choreographers, but with a PhD degree, who are working in the field. So there's always this connection from the beginning, there's a connection with the working field. So in our research, what we are trying to do is that we have what we call the practice-led based research in that sense. So practice is leading the research. What is different in regard to other masters that we have in the field, certainly in Holland, is we are, that we are a joint degree. So it means that the faculty of dance of Fontys and the faculty of dance of Cordarts are doing this master together. So it means that when you come in as a student that you have not one academy, but you have two. 
So it means also that the intensives are interrelated between Tilburg in one two weeks and the other two weeks they are in Rotterdam. So in that sense, you, as students, you really get an offer of all the good things of two academies. And that gives possibilities on many levels for them. So you learn also the two different cultures and two different approaches in regard to how people look at dance, at choreography, at circus, at community arts. And that makes it fascinating and interesting. What needs to be known that we have also our own platform, our digital platform, My LMS. And that is really the central focus point where everything comes together. So meaning on content, on learning, we have my LMS. So they are not dependent of the two academies. My LMS is the thing where they go. For the practical side, font is, is certainly also in the lead. What we want our students to have is already have a practice. So it means that they are not coming to our master to learn choreography. And that means to develop in a way that he or she or they or it kind of have integrate kind of also the theory of things that they will explore during the two years. I think every master is unique in itself. And it, it's been rebuilt every time. Every, with every cohort that you enter, you have a group of people who are meeting for the first time. That already is a uniqueness. But if you would ask us for us, so the uniqueness of our master is that we are not focusing only on dance, but also on people that are coming from the circus field and on people that are folk, uh, coming from the community art. So our group are very diverse because we firmly believe that if you want to create a learning community of peers, that it's interesting to meet other perspectives. The fact that we are a joint degree makes also a very unique stuff. You won't see that a lot, the two academies with a total different culture in regard to what yeah, dance and maybe circus is about, uh, meld together. And what comes out of there is sometimes, yes, it rubs, but it also generates heats and energy that is very interesting for students.